My name is Stella Cassell, and for my science fair project, I researched the effect of temperature on pH and salinity levels of ocean water. This is my abstract. Some background information. The ocean covers more than 70% of Earth's surface, and the ocean is 96.5% water, and the other 3.5% is made up of salts and minerals like chloride and sodium. A pH level tells how acidic something is. The average pH level of the ocean is around 8.1%, which makes it basic. Some factors that can affect pH levels are carbon dioxide and air pollution. If the pH level in the ocean becomes too high, it could cause corrosion to occur. This would break down the hard surface of shells and shelled animals. Here there is a picture of um, different things and their pH levels. And seawater has an average pH level of around 8.1%, so it's right here on the spectrum. A salinity level tells the salt content of something. The average salinity level of the ocean is 3.5%. Experimental design. The goal of the investigation was to answer the question of, does temperature affect pH and salinity levels? The hypotheses for this experiment are as follows. If the temperature is increased, then the pH levels will decrease and the salinity levels will increase. And if the temperature is decreased, then the pH levels will increase and the salinity levels will decrease. This would mean that the warmer the water is, the more acidic and salty it will be. The materials used were water that was collected from a local beach, test tubes to store the water, pH and salinity testers, cooking thermometer to record the temperatures, um, to increase the temperatures, a stove top and a pan was used, and to decrease the temperatures, a freezer was used, and gloves were also used to avoid burn. The experiment consisted of collecting and sampling water at various temperatures, testing pH and salinity levels, and recording data. The tools that were used were pH meters and refractor meters. The independent variables were the water temperature, the dependent variables were the pH and salinity levels, and the controlled variable was where the water was being collected from. The procedure was, first, collecting and rationing ocean water, second, recording the temperatures, pH, and salinity levels of the ocean water, third, adjusting the temperatures to be colder or hotter than the original temperature, recording the new temperatures and pH and salinity levels. Fifth, repeating steps until enough data had been collected. And finally, organizing and analyzing the data. Results and discussion. Um, the original temperature of the ocean water was 58.3 degrees. The original pH level was 7.68 and the original salinity level was 710 parts per thousandth. And as you can see, when the temperature was increased, the pH level and the salinity level also increased. And where the temperature was decreased, the pH and the salinity levels also decreased. The results in the experiment were not as predicted. It was predicted that an increase in temperature would cause a decrease in pH levels and an increase in salinity levels. The increased temperature caused an increase in pH levels and an increase in salinity levels. The other prediction was that a decrease in temperature would cause an increase in pH levels and a decrease in salinity levels. The decreased temperature caused both a decrease in pH and in salinity levels. Error. There could have been two things that caused error in this experiment. The first thing that could have caused error was the accuracy of the pH in the salinity tester. The second thing was the beach where the water was collected from was a small beach, so the water temperature could have been different from that of what a larger beach would have had. Conclusions.
Moving forward, this research project could lead to questions like, what other parts of seawater do temperature affect? And applications. This research is useful for scientists working in marine studies, fishermen, divers, and lifeguards. This could be helpful for someone researching the effects of global warming on the ocean. Citations. 